Crazy Rich Asians, Real Chinese Billionaires Lifestyle. Get ready for an exclusive look into the lavish lifestyle of Chinese billionaires like you've never seen before. We're flipping the script and taking a fresh perspective that reveals the relatable human side of these ultra-wealthy individuals. Forget the opulent mansions and flashy cars. We're delving into their personal passions and everyday relationships with family and friends. Brace yourself for an intriguing journey into the fascinating world of Chinese billionaires, where we'll expose their down-to-earth and relatable approach to life. Don't miss out on this captivating adventure. Hold on to your hats because China is making history in the billionaire department. With a whopping 1058 billionaires, it's no surprise that China is the reigning champion for producing these high flyers at a breakneck pace. And when it comes to the digital industry, China's e-commerce platforms are giants among men. But wait, there's more. These billionaires are living it up in the lap of luxury, which may surprise you given their communist roots. Move over crazy rich Asians because China's elite are taking the game to a whole new level. Get ready to be blown away by the incredible rags-to-riches story of Zhong Chanchan, the reigning champion of Chinese billionaires. This self-made mogul hails from humble beginnings in Hangzhou, where he started out as a sales rep for healthcare supplements. Chan Chan went on to launch the Gong Fu Spring bottled water business in 1996, and with the help of the revolutionary Shan Chan technology, he turned his small business into a powerhouse of epic proportions. Now, with a jaw-dropping net worth of $65.7 billion, Chan Chan holds the crown as the richest person in China, and was even named the richest person in all of Asia by Forbes in late 2020. Despite his insane wealth and success, Chan Chan is a bit of a mystery. He prefers a low-key lifestyle and shuns the limelight, rarely making public appearances or voicing his political opinions. So what's the deal with this lone wolf billionaire? Well, one thing's for sure. His success with TikTok has not only given rise to a new generation of social media celebrities, but also created a social media billionaire. It's a wild ride, folks, and you won't want to miss a single detail of this incredible story. Meet Zhang Yiming, the software developer extraordinaire who founded ByteDance and is now one of China's richest of the rich, with a net worth of $50 billion. Despite his massive wealth and influence, Zhang is an enigma wrapped in a mystery. His strict confidentiality means that little is known about his personal life, leaving many to wonder what he's really like behind closed doors. What we do know is that Zhang has been at the helm of ByteDance for almost a decade, but recently shocked the world by announcing his resignation as CEO. In true introvert fashion, Zhang admitted that he's not very sociable and prefers solitary hobbies like reading online, listening to music, and dreaming up new ideas. And if that's not intriguing enough, Zhang has reportedly been spending the majority of his time traveling and using Singapore as a home base, which came as a surprise to many as he had been absent from China for an extended period of time following his resignation. Zhang's resignation came during China's tech crackdown, which saw other well-known tech founders step down from their businesses, including the founder, chairman, and CEO of Tencent, Asia's most valuable firm and one of the world's biggest gaming and entertainment conglomerates. Next, we have Ma Huatang, a man with a net worth of $37.2 billion as of 2022. His primary source of income? Internet media, of course. As the mastermind behind Tencent, Ma has invested in some of the biggest companies out there, including Spotify, Snap, and Tesla. He's got a taste for the finer things in life and was named one of the world's most powerful people in 2018 by CEO World Magazine. With several multi-million dollar properties in Hong Kong and an art collection worth a staggering $150 million, Ma is living the life that only the wealthiest Chinese billionaires can afford. Colin Huang, a man who was born into a family of factory workers in 1982. 
but he didn't let his humble beginnings stop him from becoming one of the most successful e-commerce entrepreneurs in the world. Huang is the founder and former CEO of Pinduoduo, a company that surpassed Alibaba in popularity in China in 2020. And if that weren't impressive enough, he was also voted the top philanthropist on the 2021 Huron Philanthropy List after committing billions to parasocial responsibility and scientific research projects. According to Bloomberg, Pinduoduo had a staggering 788.4 million members once it went public on the NASDAQ in July 2018. These two Chinese billionaires are living proof that anything is possible if you put your mind to it. From humble beginnings to unimaginable wealth, they have proved that with hard work, dedication, and a little bit of luck, anyone can achieve their dreams. Wang 47's interest in the company was valued at $14 billion. Wang and the founding group have given the Starry Night Charitable Trust 2.3% of Pinduoduo's shares, or about $100 million, to fund essential biomedical, agricultural, and food-related research. The rich and moderately wealthy Chinese, on the other hand, are extremely proud of their wealth and aren't hesitant to show it off. From driving the priciest cars to living in enormous palaces stretched out of acres of land and wearing nothing less than designer brands and diamond-studded Rolexes, China is the number one country to buy the most Rolls Royces and luxury hotels. Stephen Hung, a businessman, made headlines in 2014 when he placed the largest single Rolls Royce order ever recorded. Not just any order, but a fleet of 30 custom-made extended wheelbase Phantoms Plus, including two of the most expensive Rolls Royce ever commissioned. And the icing on the cake? Gold-plated accents both inside and out, all for a cool $475,000 each. Who says transportation can't be stylish and extravagant? When it comes to their furry companions, the Chinese don't shy away from splurging either. In 2014, a Tibetan Mastiff, a dog breed that looks like a lion, was sold for almost $2 million at a luxury pet fair in China. And get this, the anonymous buyer spent a whopping $1.6 million on the dog alone. Talk about pampered pets. And let's not forget about their love for luxury brands. Louis Vuitton, Balmain, Burberry, Hermes, Gucci, and Prada are just a few of the brands that have seen a surge in customers from the East. In fact, around 35% of all luxury purchases are made in China. The days of being conservative with wealth are long gone, and the Chinese wealthy are not holding back when it comes to owning designer goods and luxury items. Did you know that there are 960,000 millionaires in China? It's safe to say that they're not afraid to spend their hard-earned money on the finer things in life. Li Bingbing, the talented Chinese actress and singer, has the world's most expensive handbag. This bag is not your ordinary accessory. It's worth a whopping $400,000 and boasts a whopping 1,600 dazzling white diamonds weighing a total of 40 carats. Chinese celebrities are known for throwing extravagant weddings, and Angela Young, better known as Angela Baby, is no exception. She tied the knot in 2015 with a mind-blowing wedding ceremony costing a total of $31 million. The bride's wedding ring alone was worth $1.5 million. And don't forget about Kim and Ye, who spent $12 million on their Chinese wedding. Their pre-wedding photo shoot in front of the Eiffel Tower in Paris was just the beginning of their lavish celebrations. Of course, the stunning bride was dressed in exquisite Alisab and Kim K caught tall gowns. But it's not just celebrities that are living the high life. The richest woman in China, Zhang Xin, has her sights set on purchasing a 40% stake in the GM building, which houses Apple's flagship store in New York. This building is valued at a jaw-dropping $3.4 billion, making it the most expensive property in the United States. It just goes to show that when you have billions to spare, anything is possible. Luxury isn't just about owning expensive things. It's about the recognition and status that comes with it. 
Whether it's a dazzling diamond bag, an extravagant wedding, or a multi-billion dollar property, the allure of luxury is undeniable. 